I'm getting pretty bored of my fidgets because I've had them for a while. Oh my gosh, do you want to trade? Sure. What will you give me for this? Um, I would give you this. Hmm, could you add a little bit more? Fine, I'll add a balloony pet. Deal. What will you trade for this? I'll give you this poppet and this spot ball. Can you add one more thing? I'll add this Orby squishy. Except. <gasps> yeah, yeah. Wow, this poppet is so good. What's your offer for these two big poppets? Whoa. Um, I'll trade all this. Oh, wow. Um, except. Whoa. Yes, I got my spot ball back. Will you trade your green tangle for these? Um, you're going to have to add. The green tangle is my favorite. I'll add these two things. Hmm. Maybe one more thing. I'll give you this. Um, I guess deal. Hey guys! So my friend wanted to make a video showing you all of her fidgets. So here they are. So if you open this up, I have my non-popping fidgets. I have an infinity cube, a snapper, and a water timer. And here are my smaller snap um, popping fidgets. This mini poppet and this three simple dimple. And then if you pull it out, I have two poppets. And this is the start of my collection. I will hopefully get more because I just started collecting fidgets. Thanks for watching. Bye! Let's pack another order. Let's start with grabbing your box. And then you wanted a DNA ball, so I'm gonna grab that first. Then we're gonna go over and get the poppet. Then I'm going to get you a Nido, and I decided to get the cat Nido. And even though you ordered one monkey noodle, I decided to give you two. And now I'm going to get your mesh ball. You also ordered a fidget cube, and you ordered an infinity cube. So I'm gonna choose this pink one. And since you ordered so much, I'm giving you some extras. I got you that glitter ball, and also I'm going to be giving you a pea popper. Alright, time to package it up. And here it is. I hope you like it. If you want one too, comment your order. But remember, this is fake. Bye, guys! Hey, guys. So if you saw my last video, you know that I just got a poppet from Bards & Nobles, so let's open it. Here it is, and it's kind of like a greenish blue. And if you're wondering, this was $7.99, and they come in the colors green, purple, and yellow. Okay, let's open it. Okay, here it is. Let's test it. Oh my gosh, that's so good. I think this is the good side. Let's flip it over and see the bad side. I don't know if there is a bad side, but let's see. Oh my gosh, this is even better. Okay, so it doesn't seem to have a bad side, so I really like that about this. I love the color. It's so pretty. I would definitely recommend this because I really like it and it has a really nice pop. So yeah, bye! Hi guys! So Tangled Creations was kind enough to send me a few tangles to review. So let's open them. Okay, so here's everything. There's a purple metallic tangle, a green metallic tangle, one from the artist collection, and this one is also from the artist collection. They also sent me this cute sticker, and they also sent this little like mystery egg. Let's open this first. Oh my gosh, it's another tangle! This one is so cool, I love the colors. Okay, let's test it out. This is so good, it's so smooth and so nice. Okay, now let's open this one. Okay, here it is, let's test it out. This is so good, I love this, oh my gosh. And the design is so cool. Now let's open this one. Oh my gosh, I love the colors. Okay, let's test it. These are so great, I love them all, oh my gosh. Now this one. I'm so excited. Okay. Ooh, I love this. It's so pretty. Okay, last but not least, I love it. If you want your own, click the link in my bio. Let's see if you have a rainbow in your collection. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. My stress ball is pretty dirty, so let's wash it. First, I have to plug the sink. Now let's fill it with water. Okay, here we go. This is so dirty. Now I'm just gonna scrub it. Let's get a towel. Okay, now I'm just gonna lay it here to dry. It's all dry and it actually has a kind of a different texture now that I washed it. It's a little bit more sticky. So that's how to wash a stress ball. Bye. Fake fidget trading with my friend. These are all of her fidgets and these are all of mine. Okay, I'll offer this and this. That is a very good trade, so I'm gonna trade you these. Oh my gosh, yes, yes, deal. Oh my gosh. Trading these. Okay, that's a really good poppet, so I'll offer these two poppets and 
these two tangles. That's trade. Thank you. Okay, now I'm going to trade all of these stress balls. <gasps> okay, for that, this is so good. I'm probably going to trade these. Um, and one For that, that's a very good trade. So, here you go. Um, hmm. Okay, that's a deal. Thank you. Thank you. Trading my ultimate red pack. Okay. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. So, I'll trade you back the dimple, these, and this. Just got scammed. Ah! Ah! Um, I was not expecting that to happen. I I can't believe this. She she traded Poppet. Oh my gosh! I thought it was gonna be me. I can't believe this just happened. I wonder what she traded him for. This is the best day of my life. Stupid Poppet is gone. Hey, don't say that. Poppet was really nice. We have to figure out how to get him back. Yeah, we have to figure out how to get him back. But. Who did she trade him for? Hi, I'm Ice Cream. I'm Meshball. Nice to meet you guys. But you got traded for our best friend, Poppet. He wasn't my best friend. Whatever, just shut up, Orbeez Ball. Anyway, we're hoping to try and get him back. But you guys can stay, but we have to figure out what to do. Maybe we can try to trade Orbeez Ball. What? Oh, you are not trading me. Actually, you know what? Maybe I do want to get out of this place. Yeah, trade me. Wow, well, I guess let's get to work. Stop scrolling if you're a fidget account. I'm going to show you how to get more likes in your videos. This is part three, so if you haven't watched part one and two yet, they're on my channel. In part two, I talked about how to start your fidget account. Now here are some other helpful tips. Find a few fidget creators that have been successful and that you look up to. Follow them, and then when you go to the following page, you can get some inspiration for your next video. This has helped me a lot. Also, when there's people that are early to your videos, make sure to reply to their comments or like their comments. But you don't have to like every single comment, you can just do about 3 to 5. Another helpful tip is when to post. Only post about 2 to 3 times a day, 4 at tops. If you have an unsuccessful video, then just set it to private. If you want more info on that, I have it on part 2. I've said this before, but make sure that every video you post is the best that it can be. If you follow all of these tips, I'm sure that you will have a way better account. If it's still not working for you, comment down below what your problem is and I can try to help you fix it. But I hope this ha Oh my gosh, guys, my package from Mr. Flip came and I'm so excited. Let's unbox it. But before I do, make sure to follow them on their TikTok account down below. And if you like this and you want one, then they have the link in their bio to buy it. Okay, now let's unbox it. Okay, here's everything that came in the package. It came with this super cool sticker, which I will be putting on my fidget bin. Two airheads, which I believe they send in every order. And of course, the Mr. Flip. Let's open it. Okay, I didn't fully open it because I just wanted to show you guys this cool packaging. It comes in this really nice case that comes with every one. And it's perfect so you can carry it in your backpack. Okay, now here's the actual Mr. Flip and it looks so cool. They have a lot of different colors and I chose rose gold. Okay, I came over here to the ground to roll it. Or to flip it. Okay. Whoa! That is so cool! Oh my gosh! You can also spin it. This is such an awesome fidget and I highly recommend getting one. Again, if you want to buy it, go to their account in my caption and they have a link in their bio. Bye! Let's do some more fidget trading. Today I want to trade a pack. I think I'm going to trade this poppet, this Orbeez ball, and this monkey noodle. Trading ultra rare fidget pack, going once, going twice. Me, 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 please, 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 I really, really want that poppet and all that stuff. Okay, what's your offer? I'll offer this cake squishy, magnet rings, a unicorn mochi, a bear mochi, and a seahorse mochi. Um, you have to add because you're really underpaying. Okay, let me think. Okay, I guess I'll add this, like, cat mermaid squishy. A fidget spinner. And a bike chain. There's a poppet in this pack. You need to add so much more. Plus, this poppet is super rare and everybody wants it. Okay, I guess I'll add this wacky track. And my only other poppet. And because I really want it, I'll add an infinity cube. Some marble meshes. And this stress ball. Is it a deal? Yeah, sure, why not? Hey guys, today I'm outside with my cousin and she is going to be guessing the names of my fidget. What do you think these ones are called? Maybe... Pee... <laughs> Pee popper. Next, what do you think these are called? <laughs> Twisties? Um, these are called tingles. Next, what do you think these are called? Squishy? Um, close. They're Orbeez squishies. 
And then lastly, these. What do you think these are called? Simple dip. Wow, good job. <laughs> Bye, guys. It came! It finally came! <laughs> the big one. Fidget hunting at Walmart. Monkey noodles. I didn't find much, but I'm so excited that I found these. Okay, let's unbox them. Okay, first is the pink one. Oh my gosh, okay. <gasps> Whoa. That is so cool. I love the texture. And it's so soft. Okay, now I'm gonna do this one. I'm so excited because I love yellow. Oh my gosh, this is so good. I love the texture. I definitely give these a nine out of 10. Bye. Hi guys, today I'm going to Catching Fireflies. They have shaggy needos. There's some Orbeez balls. They also have lots of poppets. I'm also here with my friends. Say hi. Hi. I'm totally getting one of these. It's so cute. I just found a snapper. I am debating on getting this squishmallow. Haul when I get home. Hey guys, and look what just came in the mail. I've been waiting for this for so long. So let's open it. Oh my gosh, look at everything inside. So the first thing is a poppet. Let's get this out. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to test it out. Okay, first pop. Hmm, this might be the quiet side. Let's flip it over. Ooh, this is so good. I'm so happy with this one. Next is the dimple. I'm so excited. Let's get this open because I cannot wait. It's open. Let's pop it. Starting with this one. Ooh, that's so good. And this one. These are a bit hard to pop, so let's flip them over. This might be an off-brand one because I'm pretty sure that this one's supposed to be yellow and this one's supposed to be green, but I'm totally fine with that. This is so fun. Okay, next we have all of these, but I'm going to be opening these in a separate video because there's so much. Oh my gosh, I even got starfish mochis. I've been wanting those. So that's it for the unboxing. Come back to see me open the other bag. Bye! A huge thank you to Fidget World Store for sending out these products. Watch to the end of the video to get a 20% off code. Now let's get to opening. First is a bendy pink simple dimple. I have a green one of these from Shop Pop Fidgets, but it's a three one and I'm interested to see what the two simple dimple feels like. And I love the color. So let's open it. Oh my gosh, look at that color. And look how bendy it is, that's so cool. Here's the quiet side. And here's the loud side. Whoa. I absolutely love the clicks and this is perfect for on the go because it comes with a little keychain. I actually recommend these more than the regular simple dimples. Plus, you can choose from so many different colors on their website. Next up is the fidget pad, and I'm so excited for this because I do not have one of these yet. There's so many different sides, and it seems way better than a fidget cube because it has so many different things to do. Let's open it. Oh my gosh, here it is. I can't wait. It also comes with a little string, so you can attach it to a bag. This is so nice. 10 out of 10. There's so many different sides. Make sure to use this code for 20% off your next purchase. Stop scrolling if you want to be TikTok famous. And no, I'm not asking you to follow me or like this video, but it would be highly appreciated if you did. Anyway, I'm going to be showing you some tips on how to get famous if you're a fidget account. The first step is to make a new account. Make sure that you're making a new account because that means that you're starting fresh. When you do, I highly suggest that your profile picture is a picture of a fidget. I suggest finding a picture off the internet so that it has better lighting. Simply just search in pop it or mesh ball or something like that and then screenshot it. Also, make sure that your username isn't too long and it's easy to remember. Also, make sure it has the word fidget or sensory toys in it. I've said this before, but make sure you have good lighting. I'm using this ring light, which you can do too, or you can sit by a window. I got this advice from Charles Fidgets 101, so go follow her in the caption. Another thing that helped me a lot is using the filter Brew. It's in the food section of filters, and this is what I'm using now, and it looks really cool. Some more tips. Speak clearly, do fidget trading videos, and have a clear background. Ugh, I have like no fidgets. I want to scam somebody. Ooh, I'll scam them for this textured monkey noodle. Trading limited edition, ultra rare, orange, uh, really cool, good, um, textured monkey noodle. Going once, going twice. Does anybody have any offers? Me, me, I want a legendary monkey noodle. Okay, what's your offer? But it better be good, because this is legendary. Fine, fine. I'll offer this poppet. Um, add. This is so legendary. You're so under. Fine, I guess I'll add this color changing Nito. More! What are you even doing? Like, seriously, add. Ugh, I'll add this poppet, this tangle, and this marble mesh. More! You're so under! Remember, this is legendary. This is like so rare. So you need to add. Ugh, I'll add this poppet, this dimple, this tangle, an Orbeez ball, another poppet, an infinity cube, and a pop tube. Is that enough? 
Ugh, what is this, a drain pipe? Whatever, you're under, but I'll accept. You just got scammed! Hey guys, so in my last video, I unboxed the poppet and the dimple, and today I'm gonna be unboxing this whole bag. Look at all that stuff, I'm so excited. Let's get them out. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the first thing is the monkey noodles, and I think they kind of scammed me because these are so tiny. I honestly don't care because I already have a bunch of monkey noodles, but it's just kind of weird. Okay, next is the acupressure rings, and there's so many. I've never had a silver one before. Ooh, these don't even hurt my hand. I love these. Next, it looks like I got a red bike chain. This is really cool because I think I have two um, or one. I don't know, but I didn't really have that many, so it's good to have another one. Next, we have all these marble meshes. Oh my gosh, there's even a purple one, and these are so good. They work so well. All right, next are the pea poppers. Let's see. Let's test them out. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. I actually have a broken pea popper right now, so these are really good. Let's see what face this one has. Oh, it's angry. I've actually never had a different face on the pea poppers. I'm running out of time, so I'll unbox these in a further video. Bye, guys. Let's trade my dimple. Trading dimple, going once, going twice. Oh my gosh, me, 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 me. Please, please, please. It's my dream. Okay, what's your offer? I'll offer a big poppet, a rainbow poppet, a textured monkey noodle, an Orbeez squishy, a pea popper, two acupressure rings, and a bike chain. Will you do it? Hmm, guys, what should I do? I feel like they're really overpaying, but I think I'm just going to accept because I really like their offer. Hmm, um, let me see. I think I'm going to accept. Here you go. Thank you. Oh my gosh, that was such a good trade. Look what all I got. Oh my gosh. I even got a pop it. Oh my gosh, it's so cool. Bye, guys. Hi, guys. I know this is kind of like a little bit of a random video, but if you could, could you comment your favorite fidget or your dream fidget? Because at 400k followers, I'm going to be doing a giveaway, and it would be awesome to know what kind of fidgets you guys would want to see in the giveaway. So yeah, my favorite fidget is definitely the poppet. It's this one right here, and it is so good. I love it. Then my dream fidget is definitely the dimple digits. It just looks so cool, and it seems so satisfying to pop. So yeah, and if you don't already follow, then drop a follow so that I can do this giveaway. Also, my views and likes have been going down quite a bit recently, so if you could like this video or copy link, that would be awesome. Bye! Today, I'm trading my puzzle cube because it's really hard to solve and I don't really use it. Trading puzzle cube, going once, going twice, going three times. Really? No one wants it? Okay, I'll go put it back. No, 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 me, me, I want it. Okay, then, what's your offer? I'll offer this splat ball and this mochi. Hmm, seems fair. Here you go. Wow, that was a good trade. Now, oh, I'll trade my Rubik's Cube, because I don't really use this. Trading Rubik's Cube, going once, going twice. Oh my gosh, me, 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 please. Okay, what's your offer? Okay, let me get it, but I only have homemade fidgets. I'll give you this homemade infinity cube. Hmm, can you add a little bit? I'm not really sure what this is worth. Okay, I'll add this DIY mesh ball. Hmm, add one more thing and it's a deal. Okay, I'll add in this second mesh ball. This is my only real fidget. It's like a clicker thingy and it goes on a pencil. Hmm, deal, here you go. Whoa, that was a good trade. Wow, this is actually pretty cool. Comment what I should trade next. Bye, thanks for all the support. I found the Atomic Needos. I have been wanting these for so long and I had to get them. I got a blue one and a pink one and I cannot wait to feel them. First, I'm gonna unbox this one. This looks so cool. Oh my gosh. So this one color changes into pinkish purple and I love the texture. I definitely recommend this. Also, it was only $4. Okay, let's get to opening the pink one. I'm so excited because I still don't know what color it changes into. Here it is and I'm so excited whoa it changes into like bluish purple i think this one is definitely my favorite they kind of have like different textures and this one is a little bit easier to squish but i definitely recommend these if you like neatos and they were found at mud puddles toys in Carytown, ann arbor comment if you have these what is your opinion on them bye guys what's up dailies i just came back from catching fireflies and mud puddles and i was gonna do a haul when i get home but i just can't wait first i'm gonna start with everything i got for emily her account's in the caption, by the way, and everybody go follow her. Okay, first I got her this game controller poppet, which she said she really wanted, so that's why I got it. Also, look for a video on her channel of her unboxing these things later. Next, I got her this Orbeez ball, and it looks really cool. Then, a color-changing Neato, and I have one of these, and she really liked it, so that's why I got it for her. Then, a three simple dimple, and she also said she wanted this, so that's why I got it. Then, last but not least, I got her this cute little unicorn push thing. I got a similar one to this, but it's a squirrel and it's bigger. Okay, now my things. I got this pink poppet, a shaggy Neato, 
this squirrel thing I was talking about. This unicorn poo squishy. Well, it's like a squishy ball. I think it has some things inside of it. And then lastly, this isn't a fidget, but I did get three Pop Rocks. Bye, guys! <gasps> guys look it's from tangle i wonder what they sent me let's open it up <gasps> look at the tangle crush series you guys look at all these tangles first let's open up the slime tangle <gasps> oh my gosh this is so pretty and i just love how easy it is to move this is amazing next the soda pop tangle this is beautiful i just love the colors so much now the galaxy tangle so glittery and it's so smooth last but not least the rainbow tangle this is the one that everybody's always been looking for it's so rare and you can never find it but you can find it on their website let's open it oh my goodness this is just amazing thanks so much tangle wait you're still here yeah i want those tingles where can you find them link in bio